everybody, before you watch the video, make sure you follow the page, like the video, hope you enjoy. trying to like one of the biggest things i've been trying to focus more on is that sustainability yeah you know, it's like being yeah. able to train and train still hard but not not doing it in a way where you're sort of um you know you can go hard for like three four weeks and then you're like stop and then you like, blow me out yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like and now you yeah. gotta like rest again for yeah. three months and then it's like you know you can't sustain that like mm -hmm. you, you don't improve a lot so it's versus being able to train like you know a couple of times a day even yeah but you're training like a very light intensity yeah. where you're getting the the muscle memory things like that so yeah, yeah. And it was skill like, acquisition focus whereas training. when i first started training you know it was just like we only had two days a week yeah. so it was like we just went hard yeah, <laughs> but you know it's like as you sort of start getting more injuries it becomes less sustainable so i much prefer training more often now and you know, lower intensity low yeah, intensity yeah. yeah absolutely i definitely think that is something that a lot of people struggle with early on like even even like man me even guys that are like high level competitors and athletes and all that stuff now that's a little bit different because they're focusing on tournaments mm. and things but in general like it nobody likes to lose we've talked like with so many people about you know training methodology and ideas it's like nobody likes losing and the biggest reason behind like increased intensity in training is like i don't want to lose and it's like yeah but you have to change your focus you've got to just make a decision yeah. to say all right what's the purpose of what i'm doing right yeah. now yeah i'm here to learn or i'm here yeah. to improve yeah. i'm here to bash everybody and be the best guy in the gym like yeah. i don't know if that's positive long term because <laughs> you can't be that person forever does that make sense every now and then like there's going to be somebody that beats you and then you're going to beat them it's normal man I mean, a good so, example of what you're just saying there is like Mike Tyson, yeah, like how now he's like, you know, for years he's struggled to, to be able to switch that off. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then it's like, you know, where are you going to go from like after you're competing? It's mm. like, you're going to try to bash your like doors in and you yeah. know, it's like versus like competing. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching the video. Um, if you haven't yet already, make sure you subscribe and like. And again, go and check us out on Facebook, on Instagram, like all our platforms. Give us a follow at bjj.101 on Instagram and go and check out bjj101.com.au to access the full video library.